Do these dumbbell exercises for 7 days. If you're not making the best dumbbell workouts and exercises, part of your weekly fitness regimen, you should be. Despite their somewhat rudimentary design, these timeless tools remain fundamental to upper body strength training. Even the burliest bodybuilders and celebrities, who have legions of expensive equipment at their disposal, still incorporate dumbbell workouts on a frequent basis. And who are you to ignore bodybuilders and celebrities? Welcome Mindex! In today's video, some best exercises to do with dumbbells. But before we make it to the video, make sure you subscribe to our channel for more premium content and hit the notification bell to be the first to watch our videos. Dumbbells are relatively inexpensive, highly portable, and perfect for the home. This is great if you've suddenly found yourself unable to hit the gym. By picking up a few dumbbells online, you can ensure you have all the tools for the best home workout or gym session. So get the ball rolling or bicep curling with the best dumbbell workouts and exercises. Here are some of the dumbbell workouts and exercises. The very first one on the list is bench press. Dumbbells typically offer a better range of motion than barbells, allowing you to build even more strength in the pectoral area. A quality dumbbell bench press will also spruce up those triceps and work the shoulder muscles as well. The key concept to follow with dumbbell exercises, like all exercises, is to squeeze at the top of the movement. This will ensure the muscles you are targeting remain active and engaged. Here's how to execute a dumbbell bench press. Lie back on a bench and hold a dumbbell in each hand. Keep each arm bent to the side of each shoulder, palms facing upward. Extend your elbows as you press the weights above your chest. Keep going until your arms are straight above your chest, but don't touch the weights to one another. Bring the weights back down just past shoulder level. Repeat. Second, bicep curl. One of the simplest and most common weight exercises is also one of the best. It works a host of bicep and tricep muscles. Throughout this movement, make sure you keep your back straight and your upper body controlled. We've all seen guys at the gym with weights too heavy for them, throwing dumbbells back with blatant disregard for their spine. This is a home dumbbell workout that is purely about isolated control. To perform a dumbbell bicep curl effectively, do the following. Stand upright and hold a dumbbell in each hand. Each arm should be hanging by your sides. Keep your elbows close to the torso and your palms facing outward. Don't move your upper arms as you curl the weights upward to shoulder level. Contract your biceps and exhale as you go. Return to the starting position. Repeat. Third, shoulder press. It's important you have strong shoulders and this popular dumbbell exercise abides. While the shoulder press focuses primarily on two portions of the deltoids, it also works a wealth of other muscles, namely your trapezius, triceps, and rotator cuff muscles. These structures all have to work in conjunction with your shoulders for this exercise to be successful. Here we go. Stand upright holding a pair of dumbbells at either side. The dumbbells should be more or less even with your shoulders, your arms should be slightly bent, and your palms should be facing toward your body. Press upward and twist your wrists as you go so that your palms are facing forward by the time you reach the top. Lift the weights directly over your shoulders until your arms are straight. Lower and repeat. Fourth, bend over row. Maximize the potential of free weights with this classic muscle building exercise, which works the back and shoulders. Just be advised that this one is not for beginners and that improper form can render serious damage. As mentioned with other exercises, it is important that you keep your back straight and knees slightly bent. You want to be targeting your lower back, not overloading it. When ready, perform the following steps. Stand up with a dumbbell in each hand, palms facing the body. Keep your legs and arms about shoulder width apart and your knees slightly bent. Bend no further than a 45 degree angle, bracing your core and keeping your back straight. Lift the weights upward in a straight line, exhaling as you go. Keep your wrists stiff and don't move your legs. Your arms should never pass shoulder level as you raise the hand weights. It should feel like you're pinching your shoulder blades together at the top of the movement. Lower the weights into the starting position and repeat. Do not change your posture until you've completed each set. Fifth, lunges. The lunge is a classic full body dumbbell workout. Make sure you have plenty of room and prepare to work plenty of muscle groups, legs, glutes, etc. Once again, try and remain controlled throughout the movement. Speed is not an issue on this dumbbell exercise. So take your time, keep your balance and squeeze at the top of the exercise. Perform the following steps and even try them at home. Stand upright and hold a dumbbell in each hand. 
Hang your arms at either side with your palms, facing inward and your feet a little less, then shoulder width apart. Take a long step forward with your leg of choice, bending at the knee until your thigh is parallel to the ground. Land on the heel and inhale as you descend. The rear leg should be bent at the knee and balanced on the toes. Return to the starting position as you exhale. Swap legs and repeat for a full rep. Sixth, triceps kickback. The best way to perform this full body dumbbell workout is to start with lighter weights and increase the load as you improve. For the triceps kickback, a movement that targets the often overlooked back of the arm, this is especially true. Assuming a similar position to the bent over row, it's important that you isolate the movement to purely your lower arm. Try to keep your shoulder and upper body as still as possible throughout this movement. Here's how to execute. Stand upright with a dumbbell in each hand. Keep your knees slightly bent and your palms facing inward. Tighten your core and keep your spine straight as you hinge at the waist. Keep going until your torso is almost parallel to the floor. Your upper arms should stay close to your body, your head and spine should form a straight line, and your chin should be slightly tucked in. Exhale as you straighten your elbows, all without moving your upper arms. Hold, inhale, and return to the starting position. 7. Lateral Raise Another great movement that targets your deltoids, the lateral raise has been a favorite amongst bodybuilders since the dawn of the sport. With an added emphasis on the outside rotor of the muscle, this exercise is key to those hulking shoulders you've been searching for. Maintaining proper form is key to this effective full-body dumbbell workout. Keep your motions small and careful, and try to lead with your elbows as you go. Here are the steps. Assume the standing or seated position. Hold a dumbbell at each side, palms facing inward. Your back should be straight and your core braced. Slowly lift the hand weights out to your sides until your arms are parallel with the floor. All the while, your elbows should be slightly bent. Carefully lower and repeat. Here is the last one we have lying dumbbell fly. You can perform this dumbbell exercise on a variety of platforms, including an incline bench, flat bench, or even a gym ball. For this specific movement, we've gone with the traditional flat bench technique. This allows you to target the midsection of your chest, however, by utilizing an incline or decline bench, you'll be able to hit upper and lower sections of the muscle group. Obviously, not everyone will have access to a bench, so a flat bed that allows for movement or a Swiss ball can easily do the trick. Nevertheless, here's how to do it on a flat or incline bench. Lie back down on the bench and keep your feet flat on the floor. Hold the dumbbells directly above your chest, palms facing one another. Lower the free weights out to the sides as far as you can comfortably take them. Engage your pectoral muscles as you return to the starting position. Maintain a slight bend in your elbows and keep your back straight the entire time. Repeat. Let me remind you again, if you follow these steps properly then after some days you will experience some impressive changes. Hope you find it helpful. If you enjoyed this video, then make sure you subscribe to our channel and hit the notification bell so that you will never miss any updates. See you in the next one.